Hello everyone, uh, today I just wanted to talk a little bit about what's going on on the channel, kind of ramble, uh, vent a little bit, just let you know what's going on with the channel, with the live streams, with Talk Gaming, with the Luke Show, with my new place, with everything that's going on, because there's been a lot of change, there's been a lot of things adjusting, and a lot of people have been asking, like on the Discord chat, and so I figured I'd just throw together a video and just explain everything. If you're interested, great! watch i'll talk about it if not fine click away i i will forgive you i i careth not as they say um but there's been a few things that have been going on recently that i think you should at the very least know about first things first i uh got a new job this past week actually the job officially was offered and accepted today so that's good. I uh, am going to be the Sony rep for uh, a Best Buy store here in Colorado, and it's going to be a good time, and I'm, I'm excited for that. Um, not just, of course, because, you know, it's it's a promotion and it's a big deal in terms of, like, a career and, and a job. It pays more, all of that stuff, which is nice. But also, it's just going to be um, a good change of pace. It's going to be a little bit more relaxed, and it's a, a more firm position, so I can be a little more comfortable with what I'm doing and, and how I'm doing it and not have to worry about, you know, security in the position. It's a little bit firmer of a, a position because I'll, after all, be employed sort of by Sony, but sort of not. It's kind of weird how it works. Um, but that, that happened and I'm going to be starting that job uh, about on the 11th. And so that's been one of the main reasons the upload schedule has been so erratic and why there haven't been a lot of podcasts recently in conjunction with another issue, which I'll talk about in a second. Um, and that's just because the schedule's been very just sporadic. It's been all over the place. And I've been trying to get it a little more steady, a little more consistent. And uh, after I start this new job, it will be, which will be nice to be able to schedule one podcast for Thursday, one podcast for Friday, and have that be the regular no matter what. Right now, it's been crazy, but that will be the, the schedule moving forward, um, starting pretty much around the 11th from that week forward. So just point of reference, that's what it is. Now, why I haven't been doing a lot of those podcasts like Talk Gaming and The Luke Show is twofold. First of all, of course, the schedule has been erratic, but also I've been having horrible network issues in this new place. For those of you not familiar, I moved into a new apartment in December, like December 15th, and it's been great, and I've, I've loved every second here. Uh, the one issue, though, is that the networking is incredibly spotty. And when you're running a YouTube channel and you want to be live streaming, that is not good. And so I've been trying to, to correct it. I've been getting all sorts of uh, temporary fixes, band-aids on the problem, um, and it's working fairly well. But it, the speeds have dropped last night significantly. And I'm just done trying to mess with it and patch it up. So starting uh, pretty much on the 8th, I'm going to have somebody, be, uh, they're going to be coming in here redoing a bunch of the networking stuff. And I'll be getting a new internet package, new internet service provider, new entire setup so that I can do those live streams. Because right now with how erratic it's been, I would sit down preparing to live stream and then the connection would not be fast enough to even stream steadily in like 720p. And that's something that just is not okay. It's I can't do that. So that is being fixed, but that's one of the main issues and reasons why I haven't been doing many live streams. I, I've been trying to. I've been trying to schedule them and make them happen, but the networking has been so terrible that I, I just can't even manage it. So that's another thing that's going to be uh, fixed. And so we're going to go back to doing the Luke show and we're going to, even though we've only done one episode of it, but we're going to do that. Uh, just kind of a generic podcast where we kind of talk like this for about an hour and we can bring guests in, talk about whatever we want. And that's going to be a good time. I'm excited for that. And then also we're going to be doing uh, talk gaming again. And it's probably good that this has worked out. Gave me a chance to kind of take a break, relax. Um, one of the issues with talk gaming is there's not always a whole lot to talk about in the gaming world and so having that time to kind of recoup get back uh, and play some games enjoy the games that I don't normally get to play because I don't just simply don't have time it's been nice so thank you for putting up with all of that it's been a it's been a pleasant experience which I think that's something that not many people realize about gaming YouTubers. People think that all we do is play video games and then we just throw together a video quickly and then 
Like it's like a job where we get paid to play video games. Really, that's not it. I, I probably spend, uh, like if you take the spectrum of making a YouTube video, maybe you take it just out of a percentage, probably 80% of the actual video creation process is editing the scripting portion probably 10 more percent of it is the actual like behind the scenes, uploading it, making the thumbnail, uh, researching what are the current Google trends so that you can optimize the search results, make things go viral or semi-viral. And only 10% of that is actually playing the game and enjoying it, capturing the footage and all of that. And it's nice to get the chance to just sit back and play the games that I don't normally get to. And so I, I appreciate the opportunity to do that. It's been a nice, a nice change of pace and I've enjoyed it. Um, but yeah, I mean, that's, that's kind of the, the rundown on, on everything that's going on. Um, the channel is doing really well. We've had a, a few videos actually do really, really well. A video um, on The Witcher 3 you probably saw. It has jumped up. It's by uh, it's right around 500,000 views right now. So thank you for that. That's been great. And uh, another video I did on Assassin's Creed did really well. And um, who knows, maybe this video on Skyrim will do really well. We'll just have to wait and see. But oh, I'm, I'm very thankful. Um, it's all been going pretty well and those scripted videos are things I used to do. The response wasn't always there and they take a lot of time to make. And because I, I work a full-time job, I'll be working another, you know, a new full-time job here pretty soon. Um, and then I'm also going to be in like a play in, in April. All of this just means I don't have a ton of time to just sit down and pump out three, four, five videos a week in the same way that you would see a bigger channel uh, able to do. So uh, maybe we'll get there eventually. And, and when the channel grows, maybe we can get to the point where I can I can push that. But as of right now, it's just not quite there. It's not quite a, um, affordable to do that. I still have to be able to eat. So... Uh, everything's going well, and I feel really good about it. I wish I had more time to sit down and go through the Discord. I apologize I haven't been as active on there as I, I wanted to be. I've wanted to do more, like, Twitch streams and just play video games with you guys online, and we're gonna be pushing the Twitch channel, I think, more and more. Um, uh, I'm, I'm still debating as to whether or not we should be doing... Uh, talk gaming maybe on Twitch and the Luke show we'll do live on YouTube or maybe the other way around or we'll do them both live on Twitch and then re-upload them to YouTube so you get the best of both worlds. I'm not really sure how it'll work out but probably one of those three or four options we'll settle on. If you have any feedback on that I'd love to hear it. Uh, but overall things are, are going okay. I'm, I'm having a good time. Uh, there's been a few hiccups here and there but we're trying to fix it. We're trying to get to the point where everything's working the way it was supposed to um, right at the turn of the new year and I think we're going to get there. I really do. And uh, I, I just want to say thank you for being patient and bearing with me as we work through it. But that's kind of everything I have to, to run through. I, I This was basically just kind of a rant uh, uh, of me explaining what's going on so that if you're interested, you can know kind of what's going on behind the scenes. And if not, that's okay. Um, I, I'm thankful that you're subscribed or, or watch the videos anyway. So thank you for that. But that's that's about all I have to say. So thank you for watching. I'll just cut it off there. But Yes, once again, thank you so much uh, for all of this. Yeah, I wouldn't be able to do hardly any of this if it weren't for you watching the videos, supporting me. And so from the bottom of my heart, thank you. I, I really do mean it. But that's all I've got going on. If you want to let me know what's going on in your life, put it down in the comment section below. I'll, I'll read through them. I, I always read through the comments. They all get sent to my phone. Believe it or not, I do read through them. Uh, pretty much all the comments that come through, I read them, at least in some capacity. So, uh, especially the comments on this video, I'll make a point of going through. So let me know what's going on with your life, what's going on uh, in your world. I'd love to know. But that's all I got. Thank you for watching. I love you all. Peace out.